Setup is quick and easy for the SureColor F170. First, we'll remove the setup poster from the box. Next, we'll remove the small box that contains the ink and power cord. Lastly, we'll remove the printer from the box and move the box aside. Now we'll remove the power cord and ink bottles from the small box. We'll remove the blue tape from the outside of the printer along with the film protecting the LCD panel. One side of the tape is folded over to make removal easy. Open the top cover of the printer. Carefully remove the blue tape securing the print head in place. Open the ink tank cover and the lids on the individual ink tanks. Remove the cap on the yellow ink bottle and place the bottle on the yellow ink tank inlet. The bottles are keyed to the correct color to prevent incorrectly putting the wrong color ink in the tank. The inks will automatically stop flowing when the tank is full. The bottle can be removed and the cap replaced. Close the yellow tank lid. Keep the bottles as they can be used to refill the tanks in the future. Repeat filling the ink tanks for the magenta, cyan, and black colors. Close the ink tank cover and then close the printer top cover. Connect the supplied power cord to the power inlet located on the back side of the printer. Turn the printer on by pressing the power button for several seconds. Next, select the language you prefer by using the up and down buttons and press OK to accept. The printer is ready to begin ink initialization. Press and hold the question mark button for several seconds and then press OK to begin the process. This will take approximately 14 minutes. Do not unplug the printer open the covers, or interrupt the printer during this time. The printer is almost ready. Press the OK button to move on to loading paper. Open the paper cassette tray and move the blue paper width guide to the letter size position. Load sublimation transfer paper into the cassette with the printable surface side facing down. Close the paper cassette. Press the OK button to make the first print. The printer will print a nozzle check pattern that can be used to verify that the print head is working properly. If the nozzle check is not good, press the left button and select the X and then press OK. This will run a cleaning cycle and then will ask to reprint the nozzle check. Otherwise, select the O and press OK. The printer will now print a vertical alignment pattern when the OK button is pressed. Visually find the pattern that has the most uniform appearance and use the plus or minus buttons to select the number on the printer. Press the OK button to continue. The printer will now print a horizontal alignment pattern when the OK button is pressed. Visually find the pattern where the two gray blocks connect without a white or a dark line and use the plus or minus buttons to select the number on the printer. Press OK button to continue. Your printer setup is complete and ready for use. The Epson print driver software is available for download on the web at www.epson.com forward slash support forward slash SCF 170.